Hi everybody, um, we are live from Anne and Paul's Felton Wool Shop and you are probably wondering whose voice this is. Um, my name is Faith and I'm Anne's daughter and I'm here today to teach my mother how to use Facebook. So wish me all of the best of luck, she's smiling at me over there. She's gonna get the hang of this. Um, we've got a lot of stuff that we wanted to talk to you about and tell you what's going on really. Um, first of all, I'd just like to explain why Louise is missing from this video and it is because she is currently sewing scrubs for the NHS which is absolutely brilliant. We are so super proud of her. Um, but she will be back in again later. So, do you want to say hello to everybody? <laughs> Sometimes I hate my daughter. She's going to learn to use Facebook. <laughs> she is getting the hang of this. This is happening. This is absolutely brilliant. So, at the moment, you're running a free delivery service. Absolutely. It's an excuse to get out and about on my motorbike. Um, did I say that out loud? Yeah, you did. So, it's a completely free delivery yes. service. Yes. That's absolutely fantastic. So, if you're in the local area, how, how does it work? People phone you? Uh, people phone in with the order. Um, we have WhatsApp, so if anybody's got that on their phone, they can see pictures of what we're sending them. Once we've decided what it is, we take payment over the phone by card or by card, yeah, whichever way around that was supposed to be said. I take payment I over the phone. No good at doing this. You'll be fine. She's <laughs> fine. Is she fine? I think she's fine. <laughs> yeah, we take payment over the phone on the card, um, and then I work out my route at the end of the day. Uh, sometimes I'll drop them off on the way home. If I've got too many to take, I'll drop them off on the morning, in the morning on my way back in like I did today. Fantastic. So we know lockdown is insanely boring and that people need hobbies and they need things to do. Um, I know a lot of our customers are doing things for the NHS at the moment, which is fabulous. And you've got some fabrics for the uh, NHS, yes. haven't you, that people are using. What are they sewing? Lots of people are sewing masks at the moment. Um, people who are doing the scrubs have generally got fabrics being donated to but you've them, got all of the um, cottons and things for um, the scrubs haven't you uh, yeah, the yeah. sewing threads uh, yeah oh yeah we've got plenty of sewing threads interfacing is something else people are calling me up for um, iron on interfacing people are making the masks are asking for cotton fabrics mm -hmm. um, so what have you got where should okay. we start start difficult to see on the shelves because you see the ends of the rolls I'll have these, a go for these you these are the plain colours Okay, so these are plain 100% cotton fabrics. Cotton, mostly around the six pound a metre mark, mostly a metre and a half wide. That's 60 in inches for old fuddies like me. 60 inch wide fabric. <laughs> yes, that's the printed ones. There's some interesting... Oh, I love these. Oh, I like that one. Show me that one. That one. Uh, the floral butterflies. Yeah. Nice small print. So you, when you're cutting something small out of it, you can still see what the print is. Something to cheer people up with. That's really nice. And this is one of the fabrics people are using for face is, masks at yes. the moment. Um, let's just pop that one back in. What else the, have you got? You said to me that you've got shambles. more. Uh, we've got more. They're on poles. Okay. Got... Um, she just said the shop is a shambles. I'd just like to take a moment to explain to everybody <laughs> that whilst we are closed, we're not open for people to come in at the moment. They're taking this time to tidy up. And everybody knows that when you tidy up, you make a mess before you start tidying. And that is the process that's going on at the moment. So if it's a little bit untidy when we reopen, it won't be this untidy when we reopen, we promise. Um, so yeah, anyway. Anyway, back okay. to the face mask fabrics. The what other, else have you got? The other cotton fabrics, because I was trying to pull them from all different places, I've decided to put them all together in the window. That way people can see them from outside as well as they're walking past. Oh, haven't, that's a brilliant idea. Haven't finished yet. Okay. If you can get in there with your camera. Uh, I'll be easier if I can go outside. Can I go outside? Yeah, I've got, got to squeeze past her motorbike, but I will show you the fabrics <laughs> that she's got in the window here. This is a really good idea, actually, because if you're walking past, you can actually have a look at what we've got. Although you can't come in you can have a proper look at stuff. So these are some of the cotton fabrics that people are using for sewing masks. What sort of prices are these? Uh, the ones on the oh, right three fifty. Side, up to the green with the white daisies on it are three fifty. The rest of them are mostly four fifty. There's an odd one or two that might be five. Okay, cool. Oh, these are brilliant. Oh, you've got your big delivery sign. Doorstep delivery is available. Leave your number on our answer phone and we'll call you back. Although she's in here an awful lot. Um, I would like to tell you what I saw earlier, which was absolutely brilliant. We had a call from a customer who was looking for some wool. And it's quite hard to sort of describe over the phone, I would like a pinky purpley wool. Um, so what she's doing for people at the moment is she's taking WhatsApp calls. So we can do a video call with you, which is absolutely brilliant. And literally show you in close detail the wool that you're buying before you buy it. Um, knitting, I've got to say, is something that I've been doing because I have been bored senseless. Um, so it's amazing to have so many wools to choose from. I'll just give you a brief round. Can you tell people about some of your wools? What have you got? Oh, everything you can possibly everything. imagine. Between two ply and super chunky. 
Waving along the shelves is probably the best thing to do. Yeah, so um, these are some of the yarns available. on this shelf and this shelf for double knitting. Okay. That's these two shelves. Baby, fancy baby yarns, plain super soft ones. Oh, and the new Bambino. This is gorgeous. Oh, I love this. I um, had some of this the other day. I had a blue ball of this. Mm. <clears throat> so again, these are free delivery. If you want any of these wools, if you're in the local area, just give us a call. And she's doing free deliveries, 100% free. There is no catch. You're not going to get stung for a fiver on the doorstep. There's zero <laughs> catch. It is a free delivery. Uh, oh, that's adorable. Yeah, that's one we knitted that. to show what it's like so people can have a feel. But you can't have a feel at the moment, so Oh, sorry. I can, I can. <laughs> Yeah, it is nice. It is really nice. Right. The one other thing we wanted to talk about, obviously, is the NHS and everything that's going on at the moment, because I know a lot of my mum's customers are doing an awful lot of stuff for the NHS at the moment, which is just brilliant. And you wanted to tell me something about buttons. Oh, bone of my life. But we have a very large display of buttons. It's a bit of a shambles at the moment. These empty bits here, I'd like to point out, is part of the tidying up. They will be filled. <laughs> oh, yes. Have yes. you counted your buttons once, didn't you? Uh, How many buttons yeah, have you got? No, um... Over 2,000. I remember her telling me yeah, she had over 2,000. And they all range from, what, 3p up to 50p, don't yeah, they, or thereabouts? Some, something like that. Um, right, but what I've been doing is I, I'm a devil for buying stock from shops that are closed. Uh, so over the years, I have accumulated an awful lot of buttons, and I'm never going to sell them all. So we've been sorting through the ones that we don't think we're going to sell. So if you're making face masks for the NHS and you need buttons for them, is face masks they're using buttons for, isn't they're it? using them for the face masks yes. and they're using them for the headbands the has head everybody seen the headbands it's the headbands that people attach the face masks to yeah because so otherwise don't... it goes over your ear and it's just massively uncomfortable for people to wear all day mm -hmm. so people are doing headbands and then they're putting the buttons on the side so you can put your face mask onto your headband which i think is a brilliant idea some of these down here are the ones i've been sorting through what i've got an awful lot of and i'm actually giving them away so if you are making the headbands and you need some let me know. We'll Hang on, did you say giving them away? Yes, giving like them Like free? As in free, yes. Oh, Elaine Jeffries says here. hello. Oh, hello, Elaine. <laughs> <laughs> we've, right. got, we've got 15 people watching us at the moment. Down here. Oh, yeah, okay. This is the real shambles. This she is, is in the process of tidying up. So buttons, but also all of the um, yeah. patterns, the knitting patterns at the yeah. back. She's got hundreds and hundreds these of patterns. Are, if you find a pattern of... online and you think, oh, yeah, that's the one I fancy, do give her a call because chances are it's probably something she's Starcraft got. Starcraft or James Brett is probably something we've got. Starcraft and James Brett are the pattern, patterns that you do. Yeah. So, yeah, if you find something online and you fancy it, just give us a call. Chances are we've got it and we'll be able to drop it off to you for absolutely nothing, which is brilliant. I mean, you've got to pay for the pattern, but the delivery is completely free. <laughs> you keep um, saying that. <laughs> enough, enough. Um, so, okay. what else did you want to show people? Ooh. What else have we got? Oh. Oh. oh, hello, Donna. Donna says hello. Hello, Donna. Do I know Donna? You must know Donna. That's Donna. Hang on. Sorry, I'm showing her the picture. It's so tiny. <laughs> hello, Donna. Right. Um, oh, I love this. This is new. But, no, it's not new. It's old and we're getting rid of it. No, it's not. I thought it was new. No. Oh, is it old? No, we're clearing it. Oh, it's new to me. I've yeah. only just had some of this. No, yeah, that was about three quid a ball when we first had it. It's one pound fifty. Yeah, okay, it's, so it's a fifty-fifty cotton acrylic. Um, we're getting rid of it because we've got a new cotton. Oh, have you? Yes. Would you like to see it? Yeah, go on then. What's your new cotton? Let me just show yeah, everybody the, the colours. I'll show you the colours on this. These are really nice. I really like the colours on this. What's your new cotton then? Show oh, us your new cotton. <laughs> That's all right. I think people Reg understand. Regular cottons, classic by Stylecraft, all the way along that shelf. Okay, and then the shelf below, these ones here, which I've just oh, been selling nice. this morning. Uh, it's very cheap. It's a, a pure cotton. It's not cheap. You're not allowed to say cheap. Oh, it's reasonably it's, priced. It's very well priced. <laughs> um, it's a, a hundred percent cotton, but as double knittings go, it's quite a fine one. Um, the recommendation actually is to knit it on a 3.75 instead of a 4mm and it comes out, out beautifully. Out yeah, pull that one out. Oh, there's me tidying them in. I'm sorry, I'm just not the price right. sign down, I'm getting told off. It's 100% pure DK cotton. Yep. Oh, that's really nice. I like the texture of that. I know you can't really see the texture, but I am feeling the texture and it's lovely. But 310 like as opposed that. to Starcraft's 475. Oh, that's a good price for cotton, isn't it? It's Cotton's very, normally quite good, expensive and that's not expensive. Yeah. Another oh, brilliant. one, if anybody fancies doing a 50% cotton, this one. Which one's that? Um, oh, it's, it's, Katia. it's Katia. I like Katia. It's a clearance. Three colours only. Baby tweed. 
That's really cute. I like that. That's what it looks like. Oh, that's lovely. So, yeah, we've got plenty of stuff. If you want to keep busy and keep going during the lockdown, she's got all of the wools. She's obviously got all of the needles. We've done buttons. We've been through buttons. There's over 2,000 buttons here. You you will find a button that you want. Um, and just to recap, oh, Wendy's going to PM us about the cotton. She'd like the cerise and the turquoise. Okay, we'll speak to you in a moment, Wendy. Thank you. Um, I better show you around the rest of the shop. Should we show around the rest of the shop? Yeah, let's go around the rest of the shop. So, for anybody that hasn't seen the rest of the shop, we're having a go at Facebook and we're really enjoying ourselves here because <laughs> people are talking to us and it's lovely to talk to people so let's do a tour that's the one thing we haven't been able to do oh my for. gosh no you can't talk to anybody at the moment but we can we have facebook we can talk right. so this is one of my favorite lines i absolutely love this what's it called cuddle fleece cuddle fleece and i love the name so aptly named because it's cuddly i wish i wish you could stroke this with us i know that sounds really dodgy but i do wish you could <laughs> it's so beautiful she's got so many different shades and colors oh, all sold by the meter she's just knocked some of it down so i'm just gonna stand here for a minute <laughs> there's so many different shades and colors a lot of people use it for baby blankets because yep. you can buy it in a half meter stretch and uh, use that for a baby blanket yep. um you have smaller pieces as well for well, baby we blankets top, we don't you size pieces they're half of half a meter no, half of half no, a no. meter they're a meter cut in half down the width oh right okay so yeah it's with the width of the fabric it's yeah. a little bit more than a quarter yeah. meter square yeah. basically um so these are the cuddle fleeces again if you want to order any of these give the shop a ring uh, the phone number is fairly prominently displayed on the facebook page or you can send us a facebook message and um, we will cut off the size that you need and deliver it to you for nothing no catch I promise you there is no catch on that nice Lace is another thing. So this is one of the regular lines. We've got plenty of lace to choose from. Um, lace is obviously something that's a little bit difficult to sort of say, oh yeah, I would like that particular colour of lace. You can always call us and my mum will do you a WhatsApp call and she will show you through the laces that she's got so you can pick the exact lace that you want and we'll have that sent out to you in whatever length you need it. Uh, Linda would like to know if you sell fluorescent wool. Do you sell fluorescent wool? Um, the nearest thing's fluorescent. She's fluorescent. looking for you, Linda. Hang on. Used to lots. Ah, oh, these, these. Oh, yeah, yeah, she does. The answer is yes. <laughs> Pink. You can't see it in no. the bags. Could you pull one out for us? She's very demanding, my daughter. Sorry, I'd like her to see it properly. There we go. So there's a fluorescent orange, fluorescent pink and fluorescent green. Give us a message, Linda, and we'll show you some of the other bits and bobs as well. So going back round and carrying on with our tour, we have got da, 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 trimmings, loads and loads of trimmings. So this is where she keeps all the gathered lace. This is where she keeps all of the furnishing trimmings. So if you're doing any upholstery or sort of sorting your house out during this lockdown, I know I've been doing some DIY really badly, but if you're doing furnishings, we've got all of the furnishing the trimmings. Shop. You put some shelves up. In where did shop. you put shelves up? <laughs> She's done spot. DIY. She's put <laughs> shelves up. I like that wall. What wall is that? Mega, is that super chunky? That's a super chunky, it's on display here, that is nearly the refill. Linda's going to do a fluorescent rainbow blanket and she better oh, send us a picture of it when she's excellent. done it because that sounds amazing. I love the idea of that. She says she will, she'll send us a picture. Right, this is a super chunky, this is one of the things I really, really like. <laughs> Jackie says so much stock. You have no idea, we've done half the shop so far, there's so much more to show you. Um, I really like super chunkies because they're quick. quick, they're quick and easy to knit with. You can do yourself a scarf out of, here we go with this one, one ball, 15 mil needles, eight stitches, which is just absolutely brilliant. Oh, she's going to model something for us. <laughs> Ta da! No, just <laughs> that's, no. That's already up there. That's permanent. That's on the internet forever and ever now. Sorry. <laughs> right, so let's carry on with our tour. Let's carry on with our tour. <clears throat> so, as we go around, if you do any sort of beadwork, we keep the full range of trimmets. There's plenty to choose from. Um, and we keep all of the beading wire and all of the beading accessories, so the earring backs and all the rest of it. An awful lot of them are nickel free as well for people that need nickel free stuff. Um, as well as trimmets, there's some. Oh, hang on, where have they gone? What have you done with them? Oh, these, there they are, there they are. Just wanted to show these. Some of the retro sets, which I think are gorgeous. Another thing that a lot of people I know are doing at the moment, I saw a really nice cross stitch recently. It was quite rude. It was something about staying at home, and I'll let you work out the rest of that sentence for yourself, because I'm not going to say it on the Facebook Live. Um, but I saw somebody doing a rude cross stitch recently. She does keep the full range of DMC threads. DMC threads are something which is really easy to buy over the phone, because you know the number you need. You don't need to see the colours. Just ring us up and tell us which number you need, and we'll get it sent out to you for nothing. And on top of that, ta-da! anchor tapestry walls as well so if you're doing tapestry or you're doing dmc threads we've got both 
So, what else have we got in this corner? How what else do I need to show people? Oh, the fixing wall. stuff wall. I like the yes, the fixing stuff wall. Haberdashery. Sorry, she's telling me off. Um, this is the fix. Sorry, this is not the fixing stuff wall. This is the haberdashery wall. So, if you need things like poppers or anything to do with sewing needles or pins, you know, all the little accessories Oxalize. and things that end up down the back Repair, of the sofa Repair. and you can't find them. This is where they are. Um, repair tape as well, because I know a lot of the shops are not open. This is a personal problem. I wanted to buy a new pair of jeans recently, and obviously Primark is closed, which is a massive problem for me, personally. <laughs> so I have been mending my jeans. We have iron-on patches if you're going to do something like that, the same as I'm doing. It's good, really. You make do and mend. Saves you mm -hmm. money, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, anything for fixing and mending, you will find it in this area here. Oh, I've got to zoom in on that. That's really pretty. This is just one of the sewing boxes, but I love the cats. Look how cute that is. I love that. Hello, Sue. Sue has said hi to you. Do you want to say hello? <laughs> hi, Sue. Hi. <laughs> right, so coming on round, this is the rest of the haberdashery. And these, I think, are absolutely brilliant. Now, this is not really massively important because it's just a little old-fashioned cabinet, but I love it because it's the sort of thing you'd get out of a haberdashery shop from, like, 100 years ago. That's where the, it came from. It's, like, literally where it came <laughs> yes. from. This should be in an antique museum. The yes, cabinet's not for sale, I'm afraid, but it is full of buttons. So, <laughs> once again, there are even more buttons. So, carrying on, we've got the dial-on wash and dye and the dial-on range of dyes. So, uh, if you are... Oh, she's got sale. Easter eggs. The Easter eggs are not for sale. I'm. Can I have one? No. No. Try and give me one of the Easter eggs. Um, so here's the dial-on range of dyes. So again, if you're doing make-do and men's stuff at home, if you're repairing, anything like that, we've got the range of dial-on dyes. These are the cuddle fleece pieces we were talking about earlier. So can you hold one up so everyone can see the size of it? Oh, which one should we have? Oh, the oh, dinosaurs, 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 dinosaurs. Here we go. Let me stand back a bit so you can see the whole thing. These are the cuddle fleece pieces. How much are these each? £4.50. £4.50. Okay, no worries. So, carrying on. Uh, yeah, don't go in that corner. It's all my shopping on the floor. <laughs> Where's your shopping? There's some shopping. Um, <laughs> there's also all of the zips in this corner. So, again, all of your accessories, anything like that that you need, chances are she's going to have it. So, do give her a call. Um, she will quite happily talk to you over WhatsApp. So, you'll be able to speak to her and see the stuff that's in the shop. You don't have to come in. We're doing like a virtual shopping experience at the moment, which is brilliant. What's this you wanted Cle to show? She's showing something else. Clearance walls. These are the ones oh, that were Katia? around ages ago. Oh, I love these. Go on, model, model, <laughs> model, do it. She looks amazing, doesn't she? <laughs> yeah, I look ridiculous. But you hey, look brilliant. Hey, hey, that's half the course. Um, these are all the ones we've got left, but from £8 a ball when they started out about three years ago, we are now down to two pounds a ball oh, or if you brilliant. want to take three for a fiver any three for a fiver i love these because these make really good presents you know if you're getting ahead i know i'm saying this at the beginning of the year but if you're getting ahead on christmas presents these things are fabulous for it because it's only eight stitches and you just do plain knitting and you've given somebody a handmade present but what you've got to do is tell them that it, it took like you lace. six weeks to do not one afternoon <laughs> but it does look like lace when it's done it looks absolutely stunning i really love this stuff the sparkly ones as well i don't know if you can quite see the sparkle on my camera but there are some sparkly ones down here too. There we go. That's another one of them. Bossa Nova and... Is it so Soleil? Soleil. Soleil. I feel that, so that, posh. That knits like that. That's gorgeous, isn't it? Mm -hmm. um, these walls obviously look a little bit complicated to knit. Um, so I don't know if any of you are regular customers and you will probably have seen Anne at some point in the shop giving a knitting lesson. Um, if you have and you want to get something like this, so she'll quite happily happens. talk to you on the phone. She'll explain this sort of stuff to you over the phone. She's still and doing her, her they teaching all service. Come with free patterns. Oh, do they? These ones all come with a free pattern. Oh, so you've got you the instructions. Yep, the instructions on a pattern. Do you want me to oh, get Oh, hang on, here's one. Here's one. Yep. Is that it? Yeah, there we go. That's yeah, so you get a free pattern with them and they it's will show you one. how to do it. Oh, Pauline's got a question for you. She wants to know if you've got polycotton bias binding in. Hang on. Sorry, Pauline, I've got to click the button. In 20 or 25 meter full reels. Ba, 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 ba. Yes, we can do. I will PM that to you. But for uh, everybody else, the bias binding, reels. we'll have to have a look. Okay. Just so you know, here narrow is the bias binding. Wide. That's the wide one, which is approximately an inch. And then that's the narrow one. And then there's an even narrower one as well. No, Sorry, I better no. put my sunglasses down. No, that's the satin ones. She's rearranged since I was in here last. <laughs> she used to keep the narrow one at the back no, here. They're so. the satins. They're the fancies. And they're then, the narrows. Yep. The drawers come out a lot further, but it's jammed. There we go. Shiny. 
Sorry, yes, we forgot the back. Yeah, we do do bias binding. I'll PM you later so that you know what we have actually got. Mm. I'll have a look for what you need. Yeah. Um, elastics, elastics and all the rest of it. I know a lot of people for the face masks need elastic. Have you got the face mask elastic? Yeah, yes. Yes, she has. Where is it? At all the fields. Um, oh, people the, are using. The people are using mostly these ones, the very narrow ones. Okay, these are some of them. I'm just putting them on my hand so you can see the actual widths There's of these. Three here, but people there are go. using them quite hand. a lot. And how much are these? Uh, they vary from 12 p a meter. I think the dearest one here is 15 p a meter. But if you're buying, I don't know, 10 meter pieces or longer, I can do them a little bit cheaper. Oh, so you're doing it? You'll do a deal if people are making yeah. face masks. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so if you are making face masks and need make the elastic, sure ring us, give us a message, make sure you tell us what you want the elastic for. She will sort you out with a deal on it. Definitely, that's brilliant. Cottons, we are almost finished on our tour of the shop. Actually, <laughs> would you believe there's only one more section to do? Let me come along. So. Again, we've got all of the little bows and the buttons and the bits and bobs. If you're decorating my sunglasses, I apologise for that. Um, we've also got the cottons. There's two different types. Two different types still? Three. Three different types. I'll <laughs> let her tell you about the cottons. What's this one? That's moon thread made by Coates. It's a, it's a good bulk purchase. There's a thousand metres on a reel for £1.20. That's I would bad, I would it? recommend that one. Uh, next one along is the economy one. If you're just doing a little bit of something, never likely to use it again, pound a reel. Okay. You, not as good as the moon. Fluorescent. Oh yeah, fluorescent. The fluorescent is Guterman, which are these cabinets here. Cotton at the top, sew all polyester threads at the bottom. One. Personally, I can recommend the sew all polyester. I find it lies really neatly. Yes. You know when you get tangles and knots in your thread when you're sewing and it's infuriating and you think there's something wrong with your sewing machine? I often find it's actually your thread and I always use the Guterman for just about everything because it doesn't do that. It lays flat, it stays put and it doesn't knot up and end up tied up everywhere with me going outside for a cigarette because I've had enough. So yeah, sorry, how much is um, the Guterman? Besides, she can steal it from her mother. Uh, one ninety five a reel. Do you make me pay for stuff, thank you. <laughs> Occasionally. <laughs> right, I'll zoom in on the prices for you. So 100 metres, one ninety five, two hundred and fifty four twenty five, and that's what they look like. That. The that, 250. That's the 250. No, that's not the 250, that's the extra strong. 250 is up here. Just basic colours, black, white, and a couple of colours. Cool. Okay. They're the jeans threads. Have we finished our tour? No, we haven't. We haven't. We haven't done the fabrics. There's a couple more fabrics to show off. Um, I'll just zoom in up from here because she is tidying and working behind the till, and I don't want to go in there because there's biscuits and it's a bit of a mess. Um, but we have got scissors and cutters, cutting mats, glue guns, all the basic stuff, all the basic tools you'd expect to need for sewing, crafting, anything like that. Really, it's all up there. So if there's something you need, give us a call. Probably got it. Um, dress net. Have you still got tutus? Uh, yes, you've come you have. Have I come past them? Oh, there they are. They're in the distance. Right, hang on. Let me point. Ta da! Hanging tutus hanging from the ceiling. She's still got her famous tutus. Um, that's all of the dress nets that are used uh, to make uh, it. That actually is. Ta da! There we go. I'm not quite tall enough to show you this. This shop is literally floor to ceiling. It really is. Um, so coming over, we've got all of the quilters' quarters. Um, so I'll try and zoom in on a couple of these for you, so you can see them. We've also got my coffee I love that. Is that your coffee? Yeah. Skeletons! That's so cool. There's a couple of velvets. There's all sorts of things in the quilters' quarters. So if you fancy something like that, give her a call and she'll tell you what she's got. Um, what have we got here? What am I looking at? What are you looking at? You are looking at oh, all sorts there. Lycra across the top. Lycra? I didn't know you sold Lycra. Yeah, 60 inch wide, 750 a metre. Okay. Couple of clearance ones, five and six pounds. Yeah. Um, crushed velvet below there. So these yeah, are crushed velvets. Yeah. Okay. Um, oh, hang on. There's a price list. Oh, lovely. Oh, covered in sticky labels where things have changed and I haven't reprinted. I've just okay. a label over it. But never mind. And then you've um, got fleeces got at the bottom, fabrics, polar fleece. Some stretch fabrics below the crushed velvets and then polar I fleece. remember stretch fabrics used to be really quite hard didn't yeah, they? They, they were, were a real I've got pain. A big batch recently. Oh, that's good. So coming over into the corner here, we've got the fur fabrics as well. You've gone past the waterproof fabrics. Oh, are these all waterproof? Yeah, everything in there is. Are they? Oh, these ones, this corner, this section. These, these yeah. are all waterproof. Yeah, everything in there is waterproof. Oh, that's brilliant. From vinyls to fluorescents, like they use on the motorway workers. The one that really doesn't look waterproof, but it really is. Oh, that's cool. And wet look PVC. Oh, you've got PVC as well now? Yeah, that's PVC, that's PVC. I've got black mm. in there somewhere. Cool. Right, let Top me just colours. swing around the other side because we also have cushion pads. So if you're doing upholstery and cushions whilst you're off and bored senseless through this lockdown like we are, um, we've got the cushion pads. We've also got the felt, which is brilliant. I know there's been a lot of worksheets going around for the children recently because obviously all the children are out of school. 
Um, and there's been a lot of worksheets I've seen online which are using felt to make up little teddy bears and stuff like that and put things together, cutting and sticking. So we've got all of the felts for that sort of thing. When we're talking about kits... Oh, what else have you got? The other thing I've got, um, another giveaway. Oh, um, oh, free stuff. I, Ladies I, and gentlemen, free stuff, free stuff. <laughs> I told you I'd be spending my time sorting out. Um, when we change the dressmaking patterns, uh, we have to dispose of the old ones and I've got quite a few of the old ones. No instructions, just the... Oh, so you can't use them as a pattern? can't use them as a pattern okay. because the instructions go back. We just have to get rid of the actual pattern itself. And it's made out of tissue paper. Oh, for paper mache. Great for paper mache. I have got boxes of it. If anybody wants any, just let me know. You can have it. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> Another free <freebie>. stuff. <laughs> free stuff. We like free stuff. <laughs> um, right, we've also got, coming along here, last thing to show you is all of the polycottons. So there's ginghams in the corner here. All the check fabrics, poly cottons down here, all of the prints. I love that leopard print. Oh, the skulls as well. That's really cute. Um, yeah, there are absolutely loads in here. And then Better again, the all of the, the plain colours. What are the ones on the top? The ones on the tops, they're ones I got a bit of a deal on. Um, so instead of 310 as you, 320 as usual, they're 250. But if anybody is making the scrubs bags for the NHS, two pounds. Oh, fantastic. So if you're making scrubs bags for the NHS, any of these are £2 That's a metre. That's these ones on the top. But you've got one, to send two, us a photo three, four, of the five, bag six. when it's done. We love seeing stuff like that. That's six, those six. Fantastic. Um, Alex is asking, how much are your cushion pads? Have what they got size? a price on them? What size do you want, Alex? Are you still there? Um, 14 is 250 14 is 250 16 is, is 280 18 is £3, and 20 is £3.80. Um, and can you show us one of the patterns, please? Which pat I don't know which patterns you're talking about. Um, we will gladly show them to you, but you need to tell oh, me which is ones. Is it the dressmaking Is it the dress? Oh, it might be. Yeah, it might be. Uh, oh, they're outside. At the um, unfortunately, we can't without falling over. <laughs> but we will try and take a photograph of them okay, and post it up on the page later. It's this stuff. It's oh, it's basically that stuff. The stuff, but it'll all be folded up. Yeah, it won't be usable as a dressmaking pattern because there's There'll parts no of it that are missing. Yeah. But rather than just chucking it in the bin or recycling it, it makes good paper mache for the kids. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I think we've shown everybody... Well, we haven't shown them everything, have we? It's not actually possible to show people everything. So just to recap, we just want to let you know one more time about the delivery service. So if there is anything that you want from here, you can drop us a Facebook message or you can give us a call on 0208 893 7779 and Anne will speak with you, find out what you would like, find it for you and she'll come around and drop it off to, to you for absolutely nothing. Um, so do give us a message, do give us a call and if you're making something post it to our page we would love to see it we'd love to see some of the stuff that you guys have been making with the stuff that we sell that would be fantastic um when i oh alex is asking me one more question can we pay with paypal i'm afraid not it's um payment over the phone with your card we haven't got facility for taking paypal at the moment but if you just phone up you can take payment we can take payment over the phone with a card so I think we're all done. Is there anything else you want to tell people? Catching me with my coffee again. She's got her coffee again. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for watching this. Please stay safe. Stay at home if you can do. Send somebody else out for your shopping. Do your online shopping if you can do. Obviously, we're doing a version of online shopping for you, so you don't need to come into the shop. But if you are going to Tesco's and you are passing, there is stuff in the window you can have a little look at, oh, which is quite nice. We have discovered that our card, contactless card machine works through glass. Oh, so you've taken a payment through the, window. A payment through the window. So she's got a zero contact <laughs> method of taking a payment from you if you happen to be passing. Please don't make a special journey to see us because obviously that's against the rules. But if you happen to be passing, she has worked out a zero contact way of taking a payment and giving you your shopping. <laughs> so lovely to see everybody. And hopefully we will hear from you all soon through Facebook or we will see you all very, very soon, I hope, when all of this is over. So we'll see you later. Goodbye. <laughs>